Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I went to CVS today. I'm going to show you guys what I got. Um, I was able to get a few grocery items, or I should say snack items, um, and I barely paid anything. So I had an $8 extra buck that was expiring today. So my goal was to get in, get out, spending the $8, and hopefully roll a little bit. But for the most part, I didn't really care if I lost the entire thing to items that we actually needed because it was my mom's card and I'm kind of considering no longer using my mom's card just because it's getting to be a lot stopping at CVS multiple times a week to use different cards. Um, I don't like to use both cards on the same day. So um, I just figured I would try to use that um, $8 extra buck up and it actually worked out in my favor. So um, first I went to the red box and a $6 extra buck printed for the quarterly bucks. My mom actually goes to CVS and spends her like spends her actual money um, at CVS, so that printed out. I am gonna give it to her, but um, I have a feeling she'll tell me to just keep it. And then my card, I spend pretty much zero out of pocket every week, so I'm expecting zero or maybe one dollar back on that. So right there, that kind of made that a money maker haul if you count that six dollar extra buck. But for other purposes, we won't. And um, that way you guys can see what you would spend if you did the exact same deal. So first, let's just get right into it. I got this Revlon Color, Color Stay Concealer. This was $12.49. I had a $4 um, coupon for a face product from the 9.8 Smart Source. I had a 3 off 12 cosmetic CRT. And then everybody's getting a $5 mystery Revlon coupon at the Redbox. So that right there in coupons is $12, and this is $12.49. So even without getting the extra bucks back, this is only 49 cents, and that's what I paid out of pocket. And I got $4 back, so $3.51 moneymaker. So that is awesome, and that is what helped fuel the rest of my haul. So I did that deal. Then I went ahead and grabbed the Shore. I'm sure you've seen everybody else grab this as well. Um, or you can get the Brute. I grabbed a Shore because it's the first thing I saw, and I just went for it. Uh, it's $2, you get $2 back. So completely free, and it helped me roll that $8 extra buck. And then um, I saw these guys were already opened, but um, with my son, not at the store. Um, these, this is a big 11 ounce bag. Typically for just a regular size goldfish bag at almost any store, you pay $1.99. So this is $3.99. I went ahead and grabbed it. There's no deal on it. That's just the regular price. But um, I'm going to Audi's Saturday. Keep an eye out for that video if you're interested in seeing what I grab. But I typically grab the penguin crackers there, which are the third version of goldfish, and they're a little bit over a dollar. So it made sense for me to grab these today so I could knock that off my list for Saturday. So I did that. And then when I was on my way to CVS, my husband was like, I would really like some gummy bears. And he knows every time I go couponing, he is not getting anything because I go in with a list. I have it already written out, which is what this is already written out I have all my coupons paper clipped together all my extra bucks coupon together I'm literally in and out of CVS in five or ten minutes every time I go because it's on my way from work to daycare and I'm trying to get to my son's school as soon as possible um, I mean if they're not closed or anything like that I just like to pick them up as soon as I can so um, I don't really go ahead and do any extra deals or grab him stuff on the side because it costs me money so I was a good wife today and I went ahead and grabbed him the gummy bears. So I was trying to spend $8, so $3.99, $1.49, $2.49. Add all four of these items up together and you get $7.97. I had an $8 extra buck, that was perfect for me. I was totally fine losing the $3 in change on an extra buck to pay zero out of pocket. So that's completely, that's amazing to me. So use an $8 extra buck and I got back a $4 extra buck and a $2 extra buck, so $6, which means total for all of this stuff was $2. That's amazing because one of these small, in a, the small version is $2 and I got all of this for $2. So of course I look at these as free because they were, I just dropped that concealer and I paid $2 for these which I'm super happy with. And then if you count in that $6 extra buck that I got in the beginning, that makes this all a money maker. but I'm not gonna count it in for your guys' purposes. If you were to do the exact same deal and you had the same coupons for that concealer, you'd have to have that three off 12 CRT 
and that $4 Revlon face seer, or, uh, coupon from the 98 Smart Source. Everyone's getting the mystery coupon. You can do all of those same deals and pay the same price. So totally worth it if you have little ones. As soon as I got home, his face lit up, lit up. He hasn't had goldfish in like a month and a half, probably even longer. So he was super excited about that. Hubby was excited about the, the um, not goldfish, the uh, gummy bears. And I have one happy family and it cost me two bucks. So pretty happy about that. Um, that's it guys. I'm going to be going to Walmart tomorrow. If you guys are interested in seeing my Walmart Ibotta haul, I have eight more offers to do to get $7 for Ibotta's birthday. So keep an eye out for that video. Um, I have it all planned out already, ready to go. As long as the store has everything on my list, I plan on spending about 50 cents for my eight items. And um, I'm gonna be at Aldi's on Saturday getting some grocery items. So if you're interested, keep an eye out. Make sure you hit that subscribe button and ding that notification bell if you wanna be alerted as soon as my videos are posted. So that's everything. I hope you guys all have a wonderful weekend because it's Thursday. I'm getting this CBS video out super late. I apologize for that, but life's crazy sometimes. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.